<laughs> so according to the description, each rubber balloon is, instead of wool fabric, is getting rubbed with Jenna's hair. Um, when we do that, Jenna's hair is losing electrons, the rubber is gaining them. So what charge should the balloons have now? Hold on, hold on. What the heck? Oh, man. Well, I guess you're stuck here. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Okay. So does this make sense? What are we seeing the balloons do? Losing electrons. What are we seeing the balloons do? Losing electrons. So the balloons... Wait, why are they repelling? No, the balloons gained those electrons. Her hair lost electrons. So what charges? What charge would the balloons be? Negative. 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 Because now they have charge. Should they be repelling? Yeah. Why? Because yeah, they're both the same charge now. Exactly. Now, Jenna, come here a second. Coming. Do it again. Uh, <laughs> okay. Come here. Do it again. Come here. Come here. Okay. <laughs> okay, so charge. Yeah, let's, let's do a little more charge. Okay, so so go ahead and back away. Back away. Okay, there you go. Okay, now I want you to put your hand out. You know, like this. And I want you to slowly move towards the balloon. No, no, slowly. <laughs> okay, slow away, slow down. Oh, there it goes. Oh! Yeah. There we go. Yeah, you heard a little bit yeah. of static discharge, right? So Jenna got really, really positive, right? Because Jenna's hair was giving away electrons. Those electrons were going into the balloon. So now Jenna and the balloons have opposite charges. So would it make sense that the balloon jumps towards Jenna? Why? Well, because different charges. Right, there's different charges. Okay, because Jen is.